Welcome to Coach's Corner, Cat fans. Thanks for joining me again on this uh, Tuesday afternoon. I'm going to review the uh, Fort Recovery game from last week and introduce, I guess, the New Bremen game. Before we do that, a couple of uh, thank yous. Uh, today's thank yous are our medical, medical staff. Tiffany Richling is our trainer. Tiff's been here for 10 years now, so she's originally a St. Henry girl, and, and uh, she really enjoys her, her uh, time here with, with us and does all our sports and actually does a little bit at, at Wright State, and she's, she's always busy. So we, all, we, we Tiff and I talk, and I always talk about that. If you don't work today, that's a good day for you, but uh, sometimes sometimes those injuries and, and with the heat here recently, it's, uh, she's been working a lot. So hopefully she's not working too much uh, um, this week. So uh, Dr. Broring, who uh, is, a, is an orthopedic doctor who works for OIO, he, uh, he comes to all our games and he takes care of our guys if there's more serious serious types of issues. He's to help me uh, with, my, with my knees a little bit. So uh, Dr. Broring and Tiff, uh, much appreciated. Uh, uh, Dr. Broring is actually a marrying guy, but he lives in, in, in Coldwater now with his family and a couple, couple young boys, I think, maybe, maybe two or three kids. So, so really want to thank those guys for help, helping take care of our, our, all, of our, all of our athletes here at uh, Coldwater. Uh, player profile, um, we've got uh, Reese Dellinger, number 13, he's our quarterback. And then Adam Herco, number 11, is uh, kind of a, he does several things. He's on special teams, he's a, he's a slot receiver, uh, and a little bit of a running back, depending on what, what, what we need, and he plays outside linebacker. So he mixes, mixes and matches and, and, and gets in there and has, has done a good job so far uh, this year, uh, these three games. And uh, so... Looking forward to those two having a having a good ball game. I, I guess I picked those two because they're both baseball, baseball football guys. And uh, uh, Reese is a really good pitcher outfielder for us, and Adam is a middle infielder, and uh, is a lefty. He bats left, throws right. So let's go back here. Last week to Fort Recovery, uh, the final score was 42-6. I think we had 35 at half. Um, just felt like felt like a good, efficient, efficient game by all three phases. The defense. Played really well. They scored in the second half at, at some point. I can't remember. I guess I guess in the fourth quarter. Um, offensively, we did not punt. Uh, we did have, we did get stalled. I think one time with the old guys uh, on our second drive. We just had a had a couple plays we didn't execute very well. But for the most part, all three phases. Uh, Reese played really well. I think he was eight for eleven and four touchdown passes in the first all in the, really all in the first half. Um, I guess maybe he had one one throw in the second half touchdown. And the kicking game was really good. Jesse came back. Jesse Meyer came back and kicked off, kicked four four into the end zone, and then then uh, Justin Kalp actually kicked a pooch kick on our second kickoff that we recovered. And so that was a that was <laughs> a good uh, attempt that that he made a great kick and we recovered it. Um, we we did not punt like I said. Kickoff return we we only had one of those. So, but really the kickoff kickoff team was was really good and the punt return team. Uh, we had no long returns, but but got good field position. So 42-6, uh, feel good about that, and uh, hopefully we continue. Uh, Injury-wise, we're good. Jesse's going to come back this week. I'm not sure exactly if he can play uh, offense and defense, but uh, certainly he's going to punt and kick and and hopefully at least play offense. We'll, we'll kind of see once the week goes on. This week, uh, New Bremen comes to town for senior night. Um, already, we're already having senior night, and I think homecoming is next weekend. Uh, New Bremen comes in at 3-0. and They also come in with an 11-game winning streak uh, going back to uh, the last time we played them. Uh, we beat them in, I think, about week four or five last week. And as most of you know, they, they ran the table from there and then won six tournament games and won the state, and they and they're 3-0 and this year. So they're coming in pretty confident. They did lose lose quite a few seniors last year, so they're, they're playing lots of new guys. But... Um, but they're still, they've got a good program right now. Coach Schmidt has them going, and they've got good numbers. I think they're in the 60s with, with, with the number of kids. Uh, concern, uh, their offense, their quarterback, uh, he was their corner last year as a sophomore, and now he's moved into the quarterback role. But, but uh, a little bit like Miles, I think, from last year. He can run and throw, and they do some good things with formations to try to outnumber you when he's running the ball, and he scrambles around pretty good when, when, when he needs to. So that would be our main focus on uh, for our defense is to is to corral him and keep him in that pocket and and uh, when he is running the ball, you know, get him on the ground. Um, defensively, 
That's a very similar defense that we saw actually last uh, last week against Fort Recovery with a four a four four look. They do a little bit of what we call slide. They slide the defensive front, which which presents some issues, especially to the field, um, and that's why they do it, I think. But uh, so so again, like I said, they're coming in with with some good confidence. Uh, they have a lot of players that you know are are, are playing well, and and I think they feel like they're going to come in here and. and uh, you know, and really compete to win that game. And, and we look at it the same way. You know, a team that's playing good, we want to take on that challenge. And, uh, you know, this is a good good um, first really, really good league matchup. Two teams that are 3-0, and kind of like Marion and, and um, Marion and Versailles. Last week was a good matchup. So so there are some good matchups this week. <laughs> um, St. Henry plays, plays Marion, I believe. And I think, I think um, Fort Recovery plays Anna. That could be a good matchup. They're both in our region. Uh, Delphus is playing, um, gosh, who is Delphus playing? I can't remember for sure, but, but it seemed like, seemed like that matchup was, was a pretty good matchup. So good, good, uh, good matchups this league, this week in the MAC. So we play New Bremen, 7 o'clock on Friday night, and hopefully you can join us, whether in person or on the, uh, on the Cav Vision sideline, and then look forward to talking, uh, to you all next week.